I've been talking to my camera, sir. Sorry, I like made eye contact a little bit. Someone across the other building crying. There's like people actually in that apartment for once. Good morning. Oof, it is one of the first 20 degree mornings of the season. And it was brutal. Um, I was not prepared. Ryan was. We were getting dressed to go take Stella outside to the bathroom and I was like, why are you putting on leggings, then pants, then a thermal? And then we got outside and I was like, okay, yeah, got it. Like, mm -hmm. I had like a hole in my sweatshirt, my thinnest sweatpants on, it was ridiculous. So we're gonna have to bundle up today. Of course I have to go like do things, but it's okay. I find that when it's this cold, my nose gets super runny in my mask. Um, it's nice because the mask keeps my face warm, but my nose starts running, and then I keep like I keep tissues in my pocket because of it. So I keep ugh, I just can't like there's got to be a better way to like figure that. Out. Today I am going. I gotta run a few errands today. I don't know the order, and I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to vlog today and I'm going to vlog tomorrow. I'm going to separate them into two different vlogs, but um, I have to run errands both days, so I need to figure out what I'm doing. But today for sure, I know I'm going to anthropology because I'm going to start doing some um, uh, product shots for my brand that is coming up that's launching hopefully in like maybe January. So I'm going to do that. And I feel like anthropology would have what I'm looking for. There's a couple of other things, but I think I'm going to do them tomorrow, but we'll get back to that. Oh my gosh, <clears throat> I always forget to put my primer on. Like I've got my foundation on my finger and I forget about my primer. Okay, it's fine, just do this. I have a question for all of you skincare gurus out there. Are you supposed to wait? So I put my eye cream on and then I put my vitamin C and then my moisturizer. Are you supposed to wait a certain amount of time before you put your primer on? I heard you're supposed to like in between different skincare products, like depending on the acidity, you're supposed to wait like 30 minutes. But is that a thing for between foundation and moisturizer? Kind of, kind of curious to know. And I feel like other people who don't know should probably know that as well. And I will give you an update on the wedding video that I'm pretty sure at this point you guys just think I'm lying about and that there is actually not a wedding video. But I am almost done editing it. I had to take like a few day break from editing it because I had some other videos I needed to work on, but um, it's almost done. And it's really like not worth the hype I've been giving it. It's just taken a really long time. <laughs> Just finished my hair and makeup. About to go do, I'm hopping on a Instagram live with the LOA. We're gonna talk about career and um, between Sam and I, like our careers, how we got started, where we are now, like what our goals are. And when we do these lives, we actually post them on IGTV so they live in the feed, but I will put the link uh, for our IG down below so you can go check it out. But I'm gonna go pick out something to wear, make a coffee, make some like quick toast, I think, and then, and then I've lost track of what I was saying. Bye. Just ended the live. This is where I sat, right here. And this is where I put my camera. The, um, the live went so well. We are actually gonna continue the topic of career in next week's um, topic Tuesday some people were asking about like pay gap and how to negotiate pay and Sam is so good at stuff like that and then I have a story that I wanted to share about why I quit one of my jobs in the workplace because um, of sexual harassment which I don't think I've ever talked about out loud on social media so I'm a little nervous to share that story but I'm gonna share it because I think it is important for people to know. Um, and just maybe relate to if you've ever felt that in any way, shape, or form, to know that you're not alone. 
but now I'm going to, I need to put, some, the sun finally came out, thank goodness, so maybe it won't be as cold, but I'm going to put some layers on, then we're going to go run our errands, and I'm out of breath. I don't know why. I have two hours until my four o'clock call, so, oh shit, <laughs> just hit the camera on the wall. So I have to hurry, but I think I can make it. Um, <laughs> I just hit the camera on the wall again. What an idiot. I actually think I'm gonna go into Soho versus down the street. Um, ew. I just almost stepped on a used pad. I can't walk to Soho. I'm gonna take the subway into Soho. And then to go to Anthropology, I'll take the subway back downtown and then I'll head home. But, uh, Yes, I'm talking to my camera, sir. Take it away, take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain wants you. the train. Now I'm gonna walk over to Anthropology, see if I can grab a couple of things, and then I'm gonna head home just in time for my call. This Nespresso box was waiting and Ryan's gonna be so mad at me so about two weeks ago I ordered an espresso because we were out and it was taking usually the Nespresso is shipped so quickly so we wait until we're down to like the last pod and then we make our online order and they were taking like a week to even ship out so I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna go to the Soho and espresso store. I'm gonna call, cancel my online order and just go to Soho. So I called, canceled the order and she was like, that's fine. Um, so then I went to Soho, got coffee and the box showed up today. So I don't think my order was canceled. Um, I got some things from Brandy. Like the thing, like we're trying to cut out like expenses. So we're getting you know, just with us probably moving out of this apartment. Next year, next spring, um, we're just trying to be like tight where we can. And of course, Nespresso is like so expensive, um, especially when you are Ryan and you have four or five a day, which I only have one, maybe two a day. Ryan has so many. So it's really like he needs to cut down on his personal coffee. And he even bought um, like a French press, but like, so when you think about it, this really has nothing to do with me and I shouldn't even be worried about it. Okay, let me put my tripod on so I can show you. I got some things from Brandy Melville. So I'm gonna do like a quick little haul before my, before my call. So this is the um, sweater that I picked up for my grandmother that she saw me wearing on Instagram. And I went and picked her one up because it's not working online. So that's what I went for and then I stopped in Brandy Melville. So, I love going into Brandy Melville for comfies, like sweatpants, basic sweatshirts. Um, they always have the best and like comfiest stuff. So I got this oversized waffle knit, it's gray. I love to just lounge in these in like biker shorts, leggings, or just like undies when we're just like lounging, watching TV at night because they're just so oversized and so big. And I love how they're laser cut on the bottom. It's like a raw hem. They had this in like blue, um, like a sky blue. They had it in navy. They had one gray left, so I was really like very into the gray. Then I got this 
Nantucket Island oversized shirt. This is the back. I just love like basic graphic like location-based <laughs> um, sweatshirts like this. They have a lot of the Hamptons, they have a lot of Colorado, Nantucket. Um, what else do they have? What did they have last time I was in there? Um, Boston, a lot of New York, obviously. Uh, a couple of other things. And then I got this graphic sweatshirt. I thought this was cute for lounging and for jeans. But the color is like this, like almost like an oyster beigey color so i really liked the color and i liked that it's a black graphic you could do this with like a blazer or something but what i love about these is that over time they wash and wear so nicely they get so soft like so soft and and i like i love those so next i got two pairs of shorts i got these they're just like elastic waistband sweatshirt shorts and then I got these in brown. These are a little bit longer, but I mean, they're just super comfortable. These are a little bit more of a high waist and they're a little bit longer, but I love the brown color. It's like, this is like a, more of a true representation of the color rather than like this up close. So they're a little bit darker. So then I got this ribbed tank. Um, it's in this, the same kind of beige color, but you can't really tell in the, on the screen, but I also got it in brown as well. So stretchy, so comfy. This is almost like a sweater tank. It's a super thick ribbed tank. I'll try this stuff on. Um, I'm gonna end the vlog tonight and it's kind of dark to do a try on in here, but in the next vlog, I will try this stuff on. And the thing about Brandy is it's so hard to link things um, because I can, the store is just filled with like hundreds of things and there's not that much online to choose from, but let me see what I can find and I'll try to link everything, but I'll definitely try it on the next vlog. I'll leave it out. Okay, I should probably go prep for my call. I probably have like five minutes now, but um, I'll see you in a little bit. I, I, she designed it the way we approved it. Back, you know, I can see it on the picture. It does not look the same and then, and it's not sewn perfectly and there's some glue and I just wanted to talk to you. You know, I've been doing this a long time and building brands. Can you, can, have you taken a look at the pictures? Yeah, we've taken a look at the pictures, yes. So can you just um, please provide some feedback on what your what your insights are in regards to what happened and how we can see? Well, what was wrong there? Because we used, you know, um, as you can kind of get the summary of it, uh, we can... Well, do you think it's like two days? Mm. They were and quick. Pictures. You guys got them to me within like you were done in like 24 hours for oh, wow. this past sample. Yeah. My good. So you guys can see that. Of course, of course. All right, just cut off my calls and then discussed said calls. And it's now 5.30. We were, I was really wanted to eat at five. That ain't happening. Do you have keys? Stella always wants to go to Mr. Jonathan's door. Come on. <laughs> we are going to party. I don't know if I want to shower before or after I cook dinner. I really think I want to shower before so I can just eat and then lay. Sound like a plan? Sounds like a plan. Barry season two, bro. I know. Barry season two. We started watching Barry because it's so good. It's an older show, right? It's like two or three years old. Yeah, we just we just uh, found it. Very freaking awesome. Yeah, it is good. And oh, we've watched the season premiere of Your Honor. So intense. Come on, showtime. Like, yeah, Showtime. It's really intense. Um, first episode is, but it looks like a great show, and, um, it's got, what's his name? Kranzik. Kranzik. John? Kranzik. Brad. No, uh, what's his name? Brad Kranzik. Wait, what? Brad John. No. <laughs> Brad John Kranzik. <laughs> Ryan, don't mess with me. What's his name? Help. Brian Cranston. Brian Cranston. Oh my gosh, how hard was that? Okay, it was 
way colder earlier. This morning it was cold. And windier. Someone moved the pad. <laughs> This apartment right here, it's been for sale forever. This is one whole apartment and it's supposedly the width of, like if Ryan and I were to stand together and put our arms out, it was for sale, but no one would buy it because it's such a weird floor plan. And now it's for rent. I think it's like $13,000 a month. But it's pretty cool. There's like a basement. All in all, it's like four or five floors, but it's just so small, like the width is insane. Stell, you ready? One, two, three. <laughs> we just ate dinner and we're watching Barry on the projector, but I wanted to show you my tree. So here's our tree. We actually got a pretty big one. So excited. We haven't had a, I think our last Christmas tree was one of those little bitty ones because it's all we could fit in, in our apartment when we lived at, um, oh my gosh, like the apartment before Sky, the apartment that I started my YouTube channel and we stayed we know we, we went home for Christmas, but we stayed for Thanksgiving and we got like a tiny tree, but I think all we're going to do is put lights in it. Um, I don't think we're going to do any ornaments just because we don't have room to store any ornaments, but um, yeah. Sorry, I like made eye contact a little bit with someone across the other building. <laughs> Ryan, there's like people actually in that apartment for once. Really? Yeah. You looking at me? No, 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 not that apartment, this apartment, like with the cool painting. Oh. Let me see if I can show you. Um, it looks a lot further away actually in the video, but it's this apartment right here. The lights are on every single night, um, but we never see anybody. And you can see people like walking around stuff in all the apartments, but literally never one person and I just saw someone. Anyways. I'm gonna stop being creepy and I'm gonna go do the dishes. But I will see you um, in the next vlog, which I'm gonna start filming tomorrow. Oh, shoot, I forgot to show you what I got from Anthropology. Hold on. I use the light of the projector. I got this um, vase. Oh my gosh, she looks, she looks so creepy in this light. But she's actually so pretty. It's like she's got some gold right here and it's really heavy. I think it's like 100% concrete. But um, I think she'll be perfect for shooting some product shots. Um, I think we're actually going to try to get a pre-sale up pretty soon. So I need to get these products, product shots completed and edited and all of that. Let's go back to the table. No. Wait, you had to tell Stells. Stells. Can you say night night friends? Can you say night night friends? Thank you. Oh, I'm tired. All right, say night night. Night-night. <laughs>